Hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome back to Legend of Grimrock 2. So, I, uh, I died in the last episode, and that kicked me back actually a fair way, which is kind of annoying. But anyway, we've got this key that I found. Don't know what it's for, but uh, it's for something. Also healing mushrooms, so I guess next time, before I fall down in pits or anything like that, I should probably finish looting the area. Now, we've got a couple of things all over the place, and... Honestly, I'm not sure if I want to go back down and fight the Rat Lord. I could probably do it now with, like, the amount of foreknowledge of what I'm doing. But at the same time, I'm not sure. Like, I'm not sure if I want to yet. I feel like I could go for a power-up first. Oh, right, there's the big-ass club, club I left behind. Because, yeah, we got this, whatever this is. Crystal Mines. Oh. Interesting. So by walking... Me! Well, that was a bad idea. Got to be a way way of opening that up, but I think that's something I'm going to mess around with later. Because I guess we can hop back down in the sewers and avoid fighting the Rat Lord for a little while. Also, I think I can solve this puzzle this time without screwing myself over. And I've been talking to, uh, you know, Keith about this. And apparently there's a quick save button that I just completely neglected to ever use. So if I press F5, right? Yeah. F5 will quick save the game. And that will save my bacon. So this time we need to get <clears throat> over to that ledge. And... Hmm. So the way this puzzle works is every time you move between spaces, anything around where you're moving opens or closes. So you absolutely don't want to get trapped. So here we go. Lever lever thing okay some kind of key uh, we need those levers over there I should be fine lever lever as long as I'm paying attention or at least trying to pay attention we're going to oh shoot well at least I've got all the levers which I believe makes that gate go down so if I can get back here we're gonna be all good oh well, on we go and apparently we're in the water now, which is actually not so great. Okay, here's the ladder. And all we have to do is deal with all the rattlings along the way. Now... What the f... Okay. They don't know how to handle me because I'm on the ladder. Weird. Well, this is actually pretty encouraging. Because that just means I can use uh, cheesy tactics against these guys. Uh-oh. Okay, so we got more. What we want to do... Oh. Well, what we don't want to do is take too much damage. Especially on the wizard. I don't know what's injured specifically, but I don't want to mess with it. So now we got this. And now he knows where we are, but... I think we're going to be okay. Because now the rats just don't know how to deal with us fighting them from the ladder. Ow. Ow. Come on. I'm over here. Here we go. See, this works most of the way. It's on like fire or something. But I don't know what his plan is. I think he's just gonna come back this direction and fight me again. On fire too. Gotta give him props. He is one gutsy rat. So let's grab some much needed ammo. Uh, some less than needed throwing knives. And let's actually go down this direction for a bit. Even though I think this is, yep, this is the way of no return. So if we wanted to, we could fight, we could fight the rat king again. Or the Rat Captain? I don't know. Either way. We could fight him again. I'm not terribly... Ah! Hmm. So something is fireballing us, I'm noticing. I don't know if they have, like, magic reflection or what. But at least it's not murdering us nearly as much as I thought it would. Okay, let's just... Let's just clear out all the rats. Because, honestly, what I'm going to do is just come back to the Rat King boss later. But if I can clear out the rest of the level, which is, you know, far... Far less dangerous then that puts us in a very nice position. So we've got, like, toads? I don't see any more rats, admittedly. And that's a good thing. We've got some flies over there. We've got this. Uh, I'm not actually sure what bronze key goes to these. If I could figure that out, that'd probably be good. So reserve... Oh, hello. Completely forgot about the toad. Oh, and he stole his offhanded weapon. Whatever. This is kind of the beauty of dual wielding. And wizards out of juice. Oh. 
as long as that wasn't his, uh, head, I think we're okay. It was his head, right? It might have been his leg, come to think of it. Either way. Uh, tongue, guitar, let's rest. Oh, shoot, yeah, that, that was his leg, wasn't it? Right, his, uh, pantsless legs. I think I got rid of some pants, actually. Maybe I didn't. Right, because I saved. Okay, well, let's quickly consolidate our inventory. Feed the rat, because the rat is injured. He is going to be useless for a little while. I might as well... Oh, right. You're supposed to feed the lizard eggs. Found that out. And apparently only certain races have favorite foods, though. Oh, right. It's a two-handed sword, which is worthless to us, because we already have things better. Now... What we do have is a couple more rats running around. Which... I mean, really isn't that big of a deal. It's just a matter of, uh, well, clearing them out without taking too much damage. Because what we want to do is find a save crystal. And, man, these guys are blind. What are they doing? Is this the crew that I was, like, beating on earlier? What is up with them? Okay, they finally have determined that I'm here and stabbing the shit out of them. Like, they really... Oh, well, can't use that. Can you use that one? There we go. What happens when he uses this? Well, complete miss. Oh well, not the end of the world. And uh, another, th another throwing knife, even though we really don't need them. Okay, so we've got like more, more ratlings. Oh, we also have a gun. Which, for better or worse, really doesn't actually make that much of a difference, but I can use it. There we go. Do kind of wish items didn't have such a charge up time, but it doesn't matter. At least our guys actually have enough energy to use their item attacks now. That is convenient. Should probably figure out what the fire sword uh, requires. Probably concentration comes into it, which is not so great, but we'll be fine. If you hear weird tinkling noises behind me or scratching, that's because there is a dog present. I'm not used to recording around dogs. Okay, so that's where the rat lord is, and I don't want to mess around with him. We can go in the water. Can't go in the sewer exit west. I think we're out of rats. Oh no, we're not. There's still a couple more. At, at least one. Maybe more. Maybe more. I, d I doubt it at this point. Also, it looks like you can go underneath these grates. So if we want to go over to the any of the other sections, we absolutely can. So what I'm going to probably do is finish up the rats. Grab the stuff that we lost. Because, yes, I mean, we're, we're essentially repeating content. But if I'm going to be repeating content, I might as well be talking about it. And let's just clear out the rest of the sewers. Because if we can get over here to this save crystal... We are back in business, because currently the mage is a little bit less than healthy. Now, what I want to do is check for a ladder. I think there's a ladder over there. Let's let's go around and make sure before I just leap in the water. Yep, look before you leap, because we've got a pair of Sahujans, or Swajans. And if I can get over to that ladder, get up, and fight them there, we're going to be in a good position. I'm going to rest, though. Mage still can't do mage things, but the rest of what we're doing here is going to work totally fine, because the thing is, these guys aren't hella threatening, and I can shoot them from a distance. Beautiful. Here we go. Now, wow, these guys are significantly less threatening than they used to be. It doesn't even do damage. Oh, this is... Wow. See, I was expecting enemies to scale up throughout this entire game, but no, these these are the exact same guys that I faced on, what, the first episode? Wow, this is this is just easy peasy. I don't even feel like, you know, shooting them with a gun. I don't even need to. I can probably just use throwing knives. I should probably get him a little bit better at stuff. Looks like we got a chest in here. And no obvious way of getting to it. Let's just keep clearing this area. Because it looks like... Oh, looks like it might actually be a little while before we can get to that save crystal. Oh, well, ain't, ain't the end of the world. It's not like, again, it's not like these guys are actually threatening me at, at this point. They do, like, one damage to the Minotaur. Even if we got surrounded, eh, the mage might end up being in trouble. But apart from that, we're pretty much golden. Oh, I guess, I guess their leaping attacks do some amount of damage. Well, I'm not sure if I'm getting that one back. Let's just try for it. Mm, ah, I think I did. Oh, either way. Like, we take a little bit of damage from the, these guys, because, I don't know, leaping attacks, whatnot. But it, it, 
it's, it's far less threatening than what I was expecting. I was expecting something like terrifying and painful in here, and it's just like, no, nah, it's just, just a couple of like weird fish people. Freaky fish people. So, it does look like traversing... Oh, no, traversing this isn't nearly as much of a problem as I thought it would be. I, didn't want, I don't want to have to hop in the water and try and find a... Uh, trying to find a ladder up without... Okay, there we go. There's the last of those. Now, we've got pretty much this entire area explored already. So, if I can get over here and open that, that door, we're good to go. It's just a matter of figuring out if there's a switch or whatnot. I feel like there's a puzzle to go with this area. But currently it's dark, and this is... Oh, dear. Do we actually have any extra torches? Oh, he... Uh, Minotaur's got one. Fortunately, torches don't work underwater. I wonder if it went out. Uh-oh. Oh, there we go. We just have to re-equip it. Well, that's convenient enough. Okay, so we're looking for this door over on the left specifically. So if I can figure out a switch or something to open it up. Then we're all good. So we got a ladder over there. We got... Yeah. Let's see what I can do. Because what we need... What we really need is a permanent source of light. And that means getting through that door to get there. Not seeing any secret switches, though, which is potentially a problem. We might actually have to go a different way just to get this door open. Which is annoying. Is there anything on this side that opens it up? Nope. Actually... I don't think that opens up. That's just a gate. Ah, damn. Oh, that's unfortunate. Because I was really hoping we'd have a shortcut straight to that healing crystal. It looks like that's not the case. Because we're going to have to go an alternate way around. Oh, at the very least, more healing mushrooms. We've got plenty of those now. Oh, we've got another area. Oh, wait. This is the way I came from. Hmm. So the thing is, I guess we got this over here that we could potentially check out. I don't know what it's going to... I don't think it is anything. Oh, right. So, yeah, as far as I can tell, there's actually, like, nothing to do over here. Just a matter of weird platforms with nothing on them. Check them out. Might as well explore the area. And you know what? I've got, like, 15 healing mushrooms at this point. Let's just make a healing potion. Give it to the wizard. We need light more than we need anything else. The only way we're going to get that is by actually just letting the mage get over his crippling fear of pain or whatever. This really is just his like <laughs> his crotch wound. That mm, mm, mm. Okay. So what do we got? I actually have no idea if there's even any reason to stick around here. It does not look like there's anything worthwhile. Unless it's in the water. I mean we got like plants and shit. Which are nice. But I, I don't know. I guess I'll just walk around for a bit. Maybe there's a pressure plate or something. Look this way. Nope. At least we got like a little while before things become necessary. Because I doubt. Yeah, we're just going to keep getting this weird weed. Which I think is actually used for energy potions. But I could be absolutely wrong about that. But if it is, that would be really nice. Yeah, the, other, the other alternative is what we're looking for is actually in one of those side passages. But I think at this point I'm just kind of wasting my time here. At least we're getting plenty of these little plants. Not like we really need them, though. Okay, I'm just going to look around until I find something. Because at this point my commentary has just dropped off to the point of just like, ho oh, hum, I don't know what I'm doing. And that's the point where I start boring myself. So, let's, uh, let's take the boring route and keep looking. I got it. It's actually... Uh, Way more complicated than I was expecting. So see this map that I picked up a while back? Corresponds exactly with this here. So, if we go to this one, this one, this one, this one, and then this one, something happens. So, I, I, I think, it has something to do with these, but I assume... It... Let's look around. Did I, did I get all the loot? No, I think I did. Okay, so that's one. Now, next is L-shape, right? We want to go for that one over there. There's a ladder for it that's over there. I should be able to make it in time. Please? Yes? Okay, good. Two. Uh, zigzag. Hmm. I think I should be able to make that. Where is it over there? It's over there. So, 
We might take some damage doing this one. This is going to be a little bit on the rougher side because... Nope, nope, we're okay. Okay, zigzag. Plus, and then triangle. Or not triangle, T-shape. Okay, so plus is over there. Probably should have checked actually what side the ladder was on. I think it's over here, though. Come on. Yep, there we go. And... I feel like there should be switches on these. You know, something a little bit more than just, like, top, hop on them. Okay, let's see if this works. Oh! Whoa! Okay. Hello. Well, we got this. Whatever the heck this is. Crystal gauntlets. Uh, give it to him. And some throwing axes, which I think go to him. Okay, crystal gauntlets do... Damn. Okay, those are great for him. And... Oh, I see. You can actually use the th the throwing axes, even if you don't have it. I'm just gonna get rid of the flintlock. Nobody needs that. Uh, I'll feed him some cheese. And he's got like crazy amounts of plants. I should probably actually start using them or something. I really wish there was a merchant in this game, because uh, we don't need crossbow corals. Because we got the arrows, which are lighter, I think. Right? Yeah. And the darts. He's got a sack full of these things. But these are, like, actually worthwhile. Oh, I see. I should probably just get rid of the throwing daggers, come to think of it. The axes are about the same. What's the what's the deal with the shurikens? Uh, shurikens are, are light. Better. Okay. How oh, hey. Wait a second. Ah, damn it. This is not exactly what we were looking for. What we wanted was an ability out. Not free loot. I dig loot, but this is not what I was asking for, because, I mean, these are great. They're, like, absolutely unequivocally good, but not what we're looking for. We also need to get him at better heavy armor. Well, one more level and he gets it. How close is he? Pretty close. Okay, well, I still don't know how to get anywhere from here. <sighs> Back to looking, I guess. Is there anything here? Oh. Uh, crossbow cor corals, great. The thing that I need so much of. Well, at the very least, you know what I can do. I can just hop back in the water and go over this direction again. Maybe there's an al alternate axis on one of these. I can also just go around this way for a bit and see what I get. Anything down here? Oh, hello. Well, there's, actually, there's this, whatever this is. Sewer exit west. Let's try it. So the thing is, if I can if I can get back here or open up a passage to it, we're going to be in a really good spot. And if I can't, well, it's not the end of the world. It's just frustrating. So here's this. That gate opens, but it needs a golden key. But I don't want to use a golden key on a place I've already been to. So let's save it. I don't actually know if golden keys have something they specifically correspond with. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's this guy again. Oh, God. Uh, hmm. Make a healing potion. Drink it. Okay, so here's a problem. We're fighting the goddamn leprechaun again. Okay. I think we're good. Okay. As long as I keep my distance... Okay, I wonder if he has unlimited bombs or not. This is not something I want to mess around with too much. Let's actually... No, let's keep him on the shurikens for the time being. Come on, where are you going? Where are you going, dickbag? I got fire for you. I got fire for your face. Okay. As long as I dodge those fire bombs, we're all good. Because I... Okay. Whoa! Okay. The problem is they do damage zones too, so I have to be, like, really careful here. Luckily, he seems to be just as uh, liable to run into them as I am. So I think we're good. As long as I stay in the center and then dodge, he's just going to keep burning. Freaking trickster! Jesus. That is terrifying. At least he has shit for avoidance. So, okay, mostly. I'm definitely going to want to invest in some... Oh, he's gone. Sweet. And that gives us the ornate key so we can leave. Oh... Okay, uh, wow. Our inventories are getting full. Not so good. 
Okay, well, we got the weirdo shield. We got some ammo. So, ultimately, that was actually worth it. Cost me, what, two healing potions? Not so bad. So, let's... Ornate key. Perfect! Sounds like something else happened. I don't think so. Well, you know what? Now that you actually know how to fight the leprechaun, it's actually not so bad. Oh, hey. Well, that happens... Uh... Me. Eh -eh. Is it gone? Feels like it's gone. I think it's gone. Oh shoot! Wait. Aha! Screw the system. I have money. Okay, so the wizard is injured, but apparently the living fireball is gone. Okay. Whew. That was not what I was expecting or wanted. So we've got. Nothing here. We had that, like, weird, mysterious, deeper passage that concerns me a little bit. But I think we're okay for the time being. Let's just continue on our way. This place is terrifying. Okay, because that goes to the Rat King. Oh, we've got, we've got another open passage. Uh-oh, that means there's something else loose here. That's not good. Oh, it's him. Got it. Got it before it blew up. Well, that was not what I was expecting either. Okay. Let's cast another light spell. Actually, we already did. More throwing knives for him. Should probably just get rid of some. Here's the question. Can I go through either of these passages? The answer is you. What the? Must have been another one or something. Damn. Well, let's, let's just rest it all away. Rest away the pain. Okay. Because this is a shortcut, but unless we get a brass key, there's no point in it. Oh, wow. Actually, there's a fair amount of these things. Okay. A fire shield. Evasion 7, resist fire. Yeah. Hell yeah. And let's just get rid of the heavy shield for the time being. Yeah, that is that is good. Okay. We still don't exactly know what we're doing here. We've got, like, the one aquatic passage. Some amount of, like, planty stuff. Eh, screw it. Let's grab it. No reason why not to. Give it to him. Go to the ladder. Perfect. I don't think we've got any more rogue fire enemies. <clears throat> I feel like also a lot of the torches have disappeared from this area, too. Because, oh, we can maybe go around that direction and find something. At this point, I'm just kind of guessing our way out, because I have no clue. Look at these fire bombs. I should probably just use them. So now he's he's encumbered. That's obnoxious. Oh, you know what? He's not even using these. Let's just get rid of, like, eight of them. Problem solved, because, yeah, they're each a half a pound heavy. That's that's ridiculous. No one wants to carry around, like, that many knives. Well, okay, maybe that dude from Sinbad, Sinbad but whatever. Okay. I actually don't know how to leave. Oh. Well, that's weird. We've got another deep water passage over here. Let's go take a look at it. So I wonder what's in it. I don't know. Okay, so what I'm going to do is quick save. Bump the mic. And we're going for a swim. What do we got in here? Hello. A cloak and a staff. And then we want to probably get out of here ASAP. Where's the ladder? Over here? Get up, get up, get up. Perfect. Okay, good. So there, there's one deep passage down. We've got one more, probably. Yeah, looks like it. It's all the way over here. So if I turn around, go this direction, we can make it. And then, then I think it's probably going to get pretty close to the end of the episode, just because. Oh, actually, I'd say we're quite in that area at this point. So we get a cloak. Energy regeneration rate, 20%. Yeah. Evasion minus two. Oh, Shaman's cloak isn't so great. I'll probably just get rid of it. Because energy regeneration is more important than maximum energy. Maybe? That's an interesting question. He also had this thing. Shaman Staff. Uh, hmm. Poison spells deal 20% more damage. Energy Vitality. Neat. What's this do? Energy Willpower Concentration. Eh, let's go for it. Can I? Can he dual wield these? Oh, he can. Wow. Oh, well, that's an interesting consideration. In that case, I'm going to give him the shield. He's going to get out encumbered, isn't he? Dang. It's, yeah, the, pro the problem is each of these bombs is heavy. So you know what? Let's just give them to 
him? I don't know. I'll probably just start using them. Who's got the fire bombs, by the way? None of these guys. Oh, no, either way. Let's feed the wizard. Hunger. Oh, he's got all the fire bombs. Okay. Well, in that case, fire bombs of the wizard. And. Yeah, we already opened that up. Oh! Hey, that that's how we leave. Okay, well, let's quick save again. Go down. And then figure out what we got here. It's dark and it's creepy in here, and I don't like it. So that, that opens that, but let's quickly go get some... Oh, shoot. Oh, this is, like, super risky. Okay. Whew. Oh! Ow. Okay. So we got the door open. We've got a mysterious sack. And party should be fine for a little bit. I really wish there was, like, a water-breathing spell. But I don't think we have it yet. It could very well exist. So let's get over here, grab the sack, give it to the wizard... Maybe, oh, uh, shoot, that encumbered him. Uh, encumbered, underwater, bad news bears. Okay. Where the heck crap are we? Okay, first, he's got a sack. What's the sack got in it? Potion of Vitality. Ooh. Let's give it to him. Everybody's inventory is full. I don't like it when everybody's inventory is full. Well, let's feed him an egg, because apparently he likes eggs. Potion of Vitality to the lizard. Okay, next up. Give the sack to the wizard. Go back to the wizard. Give the fire bombs to the lizard. Um, let's just throw the heavy armor in here. It's not like he's going to be using it. I'll get rid of the mining pick. I think the mining pick's just a generic weapon at this point. Uh, compass timepiece. Well, we don't need this map anymore, actually. That's completely worthless to us. Anti-venom. We also have, like, these weapons. Might as well get rid of them, actually. They're not good. Why is he even carrying them around? I don't know. Either way. Where are we, and what are we doing here? Hopefully there's a shortcut. Well, let's keep our eyes out, just because sometimes secrets like this are dangerous. I'm hearing weird noises. I see fish. I think I can actually grab fish. Ooh, lockpicks. We need lockpicks. Give them to Smuggles, even though Smuggles isn't really the man that needs them. Oh, well, uh, I think we're in a good position here. I don't see anybody trying to kill us. We just have to figure out the puzzle of the random plants in the middle of the area. So yeah, there's our junk. Okay, so we can get into the water. We can get out of the water. So let's grab these. I'll grab the fish at some point. Let's get air. Oh, well. Guess hand him fish. Because we got this. There's got to be a lever somewhere. I just don't know where. Hmm. Let's inspect the walls as we go by this time. Because there's there's a something there, and if I can get to it, we're in a great position. But if we can't, I don't know. I feel like I'm missing something here. Unless, like, it requires me to chuck something onto the grassy areas. What if I tried, like, a fireball? Wow, those plants are immune to fire. Weird. Oh, maybe it's this one, actually. No. Well, color me confused. Found it. I found it. It's over here. And you know that random-ass gold key I got? Works. Not actually... Yeah, I, I think keys like that can actually be saved and used for other things. Either way. Let's get through here. Grab this. Crystal shield. Where's that ladder? Oh, it's all the way over here. Well, either way. Let's see what this does. Holy... Hmm. That's interesting. Okay. So that is actually best given to him. Because this is... Um, he only has a number of charges. That's disappointing. But... Whoops! Just yanked the headphones out of the microphone. Luckily, you guys can still hear me. Just noises. Noises, noises, noises. I'm just doing a bad job of... Uh, minding the mic right now. So the thing is, the crystal shield... Probably better than what we got here. What's this do? Energy willpower. Not exactly what does willpower do? Cold resistance, energy points you have. Versus just energy and vitality. So how much does his health change when I do that? It's about 10. It doesn't tell me his regen rates. You know what? I'm just going to give him the shield. It's useless to him right now in the state he's in. So you know what? Let's just hand him the dinky healing potion that he's never going to be able to use. 
and continue on our way. Is he not? Oh, he doesn't have gloves. <laughs> we have not actually finished uh, decking everybody out. So we also got a bear pelt, which I totally forgot to give the uh, put on the minotaur. And reed helmet's probably not going to do him any good. Because, yeah, he's got the skull helmet, and he's got the rogue hood, and he's got that. So let's actually get rid of that. <laughs> we just hurl it in a different direction. That's great. Okay, so I think that's it for this area. Uh, apart from one, th one thing about this area, all of these fish respawn. So if, like, we're low on health, or, yeah, essentially if we're, we're running low on food, actually, we can come all the way back here and just get a butt ton of fish. I have no idea if there's, like, a, a limitation. I don't think there is. Let's just throw a bunch of fish at these guys. I don't think anybody likes fish, so I can just hand them out. Because, yeah, we don't. there's no feline race in this game. I'd be okay if there was one, but at the same time, yeah, whatever. I might as well feed the Minotaur. I don't actually even know if he can be fed. Oh, yeah. So apparently he's been starving this entire time, but the the neck chain makes him immune to starv starvation. Weird. Well, either way, uh, that's it for here. So now we can hop back in the water. And it's dark down here. I really should have cast light before I hop down. Oh, well, we'll be fine, I think. Oh, God, this is this might end up being a problem. Okay, that was close. Let's just rest for a bit. Eh, that's good enough. And then we can be on our merry, merry way, because we know where the ladder out of here is. We're probably going to have to take an alternate route in and out, simply to... Uh, simply... Oh, wait. Oh, the ladder's back over this direction. Whoops. Okay, now, is this door... Yeah, this door is just flat out open. I think, yeah, it's it's like right here. And then we go up, and I have no idea where we end up. But I'm okay with that, because it's going to drop us back over to the overworld. And we can figure things out. Ah! Forgot, don't turn while on stairs. You end up just going places. Okay, so we've got a save crystal here. It's probably a good time to actually stop at the save crystal. Let's head over there. Actually, we don't even need to. So you know what? Let's go back, finish this puzzle that I started. Which is... Oh, wait, no. That's... N yeah, this, this is the one we want. So, let's get out here. Oh, that... Does that reset it? It does. Oh. So, I have to complete this in one go. Oh, hey, there's a healing potion here. Well, you know what? I'll get this on the next episode, I guess. So... I'll see you guys then, and as always, thanks for watching, because, oh hey, here's another exit, that's convenient. Or, or not? Okay, yeah it is. So, as I was saying, see you guys next time, and as always, thanks for watching.